morning. Got a new camera. Clever, isn't it? Just broke that, so now I'm moving on to this. So in here, got a metal bell crank, 6S ESC, Traxxas battery, metal ESC, um, metal uh, gearbox cover, uh, 23 stock pinion back on, sledgehammers back on, so slightly smaller wheels, but the faster pinion, running a 6S ESC on 4S with a Traxxas X Max servo and aluminium bell crank. So I did did um, I did drive this um, I did drive this last I did drive this last um, last week, but managed to record the sky for 20 minutes. So that was good. Um, so I went out and bought a new camera, Mini Beast. That's this. Good in it. Linked Max. It's supposed to be that actually, but anyway, whatever. Don't know why it's doing that. It's supposed to be the Mini Beast. Let's see if that works. Yeah. Done. Because you can name them, which is good in it. But anyway. So yeah, came last week, spent about an hour down here videoing both cars and it was a total disaster because I videoed the sky. So I went out and bought a GoPro type thing. But anyway, last week, this was brilliant on this larger ESC. I don't know if that really makes much difference, but maybe it does, I don't know. Larger ESC, original turnbuckle, uh, original pinion. So yeah, original pinion. Original tyres, VXL 6S ESC, and the Traxxas battery, and it absolutely flew. It was brilliant. So hopefully I can catch a bit of that today. So this is the second time I've driven it like this. And it was ace best it's ever driven albeit quite hard to steer but hopefully you can see it it really it really does shift it backflips obviously if you've bored yourself with these videos that I've already done you'll see that normally when I do a backflip with this it's like last minute and it's full throttle and then it just about just about makes it about an inch from the ground um, but now oh, but now it seems able to backflip in plenty of time There you go, look. So, not sure why that is. Could it be the battery, this big milliamp battery. Low center of gravity, because it's kind of a stretched battery rather than a, if you've ever seen it, it's really long. It kind of fills the battery tray completely. There's no movement, it's really good. And it sits really low, because obviously it's, it's length, it's lengthways, that's where it's size seems to be, kind of in it's length, if that makes sense, rather than it's thickness. Or maybe it's this bigger ESC. 
which is the ESC out of the um, ESC out of the sledge and I presume the ESC out of the um, Max Slash could be wrong but I think it is it's also very responsive on the steering now it's made of metal it's very it's got a very rear uh, weight bias so when it goes up in the air slowly you'll notice it seems to want to land on its backside like, like that so when it goes up it seems to hang its arse out and then you get those nasty kind of back end shunts. So for some reason on this one, when I turn the uh, TSM up, and this is since I swapped the since I swapped the uh, ESC, if I turn it, can you see it doesn't correct? It behaves ever so strange. The uh, stability does. Don't know why that is. So TSM now doesn't really work. It seems to steer against itself. like it's working the opposite of what you'd want so when you turn it up it doesn't steer against it sort of steers in I'm not sure why that is so I'm seeming to have to turn the TSM off means it's quite hard to control because I've got no um, no stability it's all right just got to be gentle with it sort of slides
better though, isn't it? Quite a handful now. Which it didn't it didn't used to be. Definitely wasn't a handful before, it was slow. Now it rips, doesn't it? And it's got air control, which it didn't have before. That would have been a nose end, that would have. Not now. Not now I've spent 80 quid on a 6 SESC. All that's changed. So I'm easy up, to, I've got to be up to a grand on it. I suppose if you take the batteries out and, the, and that control, you know, and the uh, Traxxas controller. If you take that out of the equation. Then. Take that out of the equation, just on the car itself. I think the car was about 580. The new shell was. 80 quid I think so that's you're already up to 650 there aren't you just in that so yeah spent a few quid on it <laughs> but it's getting there now isn't it but you know one thing I haven't done is broken a four pound arm because in reality, that's what you're on about, isn't it? You, you say it's it's got a lot of um, durability, and it, it has. You know, it's never broke a hub, or it's never bent a hinge pin, or anything like that. Um, but I think the arms are about eight quid. The hubs are nothing. The parts are dead cheap. So the stuff that doesn't break is great, but they're also cheap. So. What it what it has broke is you know is a few gears. Um, so I suppose not too bad really. It's only really been the gears that have been the issue, and the fact it was dead slow. Well, that seems to have been resolved now. And the reason I put a, a VXL ESC in is because I quite like the, I like the app. You know, I like that. I just it's geeky, isn't it? I just quite like fiddling around with the app. You don't really. I just like it to stay sort of tracks us. I think I've blown about tire. You know, see that one on the left. See that where it's coming off. Yeah, I've blown it. Look, it's come off. It's come off on the inside. It's absolutely full of gravel. So there we go. Look, you see.
try and get this TSM to work. So it obviously doesn't work like normal. I wonder if it even is on. I if it's working. Because you'd think then as a gyro it would correct as I swung it, but it's not. I wonder if it's not working. I think the tyres are cheap. I think these ones are cheap. But you know, now I know to glue the insides. I've never really had one go on the inside before. It's normally the outside, isn't it? Jesus Christ, that overtook itself. I was hoping that would... Um, I was hoping that would come down. But it didn't. Full pin. She's done. Battery gone. So I might just have enough battery to drive it to the car. So yeah. 6S, 6S VXL ESC. Metal turnbuckle. Dodgy. So it's doing something, but just not. Can you see how it slowly comes back then when you turn it off come straight back who knows right obviously this time of the morning is um, mum's walking the kids time so probably avoid this like the plague in future um, but yeah 6S, 6S VXL makes it really fast blown a tyre could have been worse done a done an opinion on that so successful day really <laughs> uh, lovely day as well lovely morning lovely morning look at this fantastic got some um, night trainers on for those who were following my footwear footwear fashions so I hope the new uh, camera worked all right I'm hopeful it did look after yourselves see you soon Try to turn it off now. <laughs>